I left Habayaki for my ride on the ferry back to Auckland to get a taste of Auckland, where you can dress up for the pop-up food and drink stands. Tonight, you get a taste of what's hot on the culinary scene. It's quite hot. So I started in the hottest place here, the tasting shed, in the dirt and in heels. So you have to um, take your shoes off and walk on the coals. <laughs> Chef Riwi is a hangi master preparing a hangi, a traditional Maori feast cooked below ground on steaming hot rocks. Some of these rocks are my grandfather's, so he's like 80 years old, some of them. And check this out, these guys have been marinating for four days. The slow process. It's uh, cooking with love. It's cooking with love. Part of their tapestry, part of their DNA. Yeah, it's the aroha. Their aroha. And now to try this pork dish prepared with the tasting shed's aroha. That's Mary for love. Good thing we prepared you for the dribble. <laughs> And who better to show me around than Master Chef alum Grace Ramirez, who moved to Auckland from New York for love. You know, I'm a quarter kiwi. <laughs> New Zealand teaches you to relax, <laughs> to sweet as. It's all good, it's all fine. Just chill a little bit. This place is world class. The food is world class, like the oysters, the maharangi oysters. Ha have you had them? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. You had me at hello. <laughs> yes. Wiggle, wiggle. Is that like abracadabra? It is wiggle, wiggle. Like abracadabra for voices. And then if you turn your wrist and yes, oh. yes, yes, yes. yes. I thought I have to eat it now. Tomorrow. I think you should. Cheers, Kyle. Cheers, cheers. Mmm, fantastic. Best oysters, taste of Auckland. Because it came from you, <laughs> I love it even more. <laughs>